Hey everybody, we're down here in Chula Vista, down in the East Lake area. We're going to 1199 Calle Tesoro here in the La Vida complex. It's a nice uh, complex, it's got a gate here with the security code. You also have clickers to get through if you live in here. It's one of my favorite units we have for sale in this area. If I was gonna move down to Chula Vista, I think this would be a pretty good option. It's a three bedroom, two and a half bath, it's 1,300, what is it? 1,335 square feet. It was built in 1998, has a two car attached garage. It is a uh, PUD. Um, there's a pool here within the complex for the community. And uh, let's go in, we'll go in and take a look at it here. But let me show you the outside here real quick. As we drive up, here's the sign in the window of the garage. And we'll go inside and take a closer look. All right, so here we are at 1199 Calle Tesoro. This is the front of the subject. Attached two-car garage. Here's the front door. Let's go in and take a look inside. The entryway, let's get a wider angle here on the living room. Here's the living room. This is a home that we did have painted. We had the carpets cleaned. We had the uh, kitchen cabinets stained and resealed. Um, I believe the appliances are the same. That is the kitchen, entryway, staircase upstairs, living room, gas fireplace. We've got a small yard here in the back. Pretty small. But look around the other side. Got an AC unit there, and a gate that goes out to the front, out to the street. We got our padlock on there. Chula Vista is a real stickler on securing property. So here's the uh, dining area, and There's a half bath. It's lovely, isn't it? Just lovely. Here's your attached two car garage. The water heater, forced air unit, uh, washer dryer hookups. Got room for full size washer dryer. And of course, two car garage. Look at that. Look at that. You even have a water hookup for everybody that wants to have an ice maker. We've got a small closet here in the hallway. Some nice additional storage there in the back. Look at that, it wraps around. Plenty of storage, huh? What a deal. Also, I think I forgot to take a photo out in the garage here. There's some additional storage up, up above. There in some cabinets. Let's go upstairs. windows can never get clean. Alright, we're upstairs here. There's a view back down the staircase. Here is the, I guess, bedroom number three.
H2O. Just taking a look at the neighbors here. They're in desperate need of a landscaper. Wow. I wonder if that home's in foreclosure. It's got to be. There's no way anybody will let the weeds grow up like that. That's crazy. I don't know if you can really tell how tall that is on the camera, but that's pretty tall. closet area here in the bedroom. Here's another full bath. Second full bath. With a bathtub slash shower. Here's bedroom number two. And the master bedroom. Got some storage here, it looks like, as you walk in on the left. Some cabinets. There is the bedroom. Of course, our another Fannie Mae sign. Here's the closet. Pretty good sized closet. I don't know if my wife would consider it good size, but you know what she would. She would consider it good size, but the thing is, I would only have about this much, and she would have the rest. And even I guarantee you, even if I only had this bar, every couple of weeks I'd see a couple of her items show up on my side of the closet. So, ladies, may or may not be a good size closet. It's hard to tell, but. The room itself is about six by six or seven by seven. And here's the bathroom. Look at that. What a deal, huh? His and hers. Man, that's the one of the greatest features. You can find in a home if you're married. Anybody that's watching this video that's married can definitely sympathize with me. And there's a nice oversized bathtub, shower. So again, this is a three bedroom, two and a half bath. It's listed at 274,900. The address is 1199 Calle Tesoro here in Chula Vista in the East Lake area. It's one of my favorite listings down in this area in this price range. I think you get a lot of home for the money. I think it's a nice complex, it's nice amenities, it has a pool, spa, and you're close to everything. You're just 10 minutes from the 805 freeway, you're 3 or 4 minutes from the 125, which is a toll road, but if you live in this area, it's a nice toll road to pay for. It gets you into downtown San Diego pretty quickly. You just have to cut over on the 94. So, anyways, hope everybody's having a great day, and remember to go to tmagular.com for all your bank-owned listings in San Diego County, and we'll get back to you later. Thanks, bye.